looks more like a guy. Something going fast. Sharp. Sure. How about a winner? Maybe red wave someone who wins. Fast. Light. My name is John David Villarino and I am the engineer of Zoom. Hello, my name is Alice Norris and I am the design expert for Zoom. On average, the shark finishes 3 meters in 2.7 seconds. This is made possible by our gear ratio, which is 3 to 1. After heaps of research and trials, of different gear trends and combinations, I decided that 3 to 1 would be the best applicable gear ratio for our given task, which is going fast. To figure out what our target audience wanted, I made a survey which I then used to go around at primary recess uh, interviewing kids asking them uh, types of things such as what they looked for in a car, what kinds of colors, shapes, um, sizes, and who they think would buy the product for them. After getting the results from a marketing expert, we chose the design of the shock. We used paper mache to create the body, but since the shock has rather, a rather complex body structure, we needed to also create the car body to complex with three parts, the head, the body, and the tail. It is eco-friendly as it is made out of paper mache. We used all this old recycled newspaper and turned it into more rather beneficial machine, which is our car. We also used acrylic paint, which was water-based, which is also eco-friendly. Well, given its durability, it's rather awesome and appealing design to children, and with its speed, we would say the, the Jark should cost around 19 francs 95. Competing with other teams' toy car prices, we decided this price would not only be reasonable, but also affordable. I'm sure they won't break it easily. This is because Jark is durable and made of thick layers of paper mache. Though it is heavy, it is still durable and it still does make 3 meters in under 3 seconds as we also made its chassis a bit smaller. It's fast! Well wow.